here we are with John from Paradigm Anthem and um, he's going to talk to us a little bit about this beauty and it's not just the car. Yes, well, we brought the car in to, to just complement the speakers for today and uh, color match the best we could as well. So uh, actually what we're looking at here today is a very late stage concept series from Paradigm. This will be our new flagship uh, and what we're looking at this tall beautiful speaker here uh, is an active hybrid speaker. So there's a lot behind that you're not seeing. On the front you're seeing two bass drivers but in fact there are also two rear firing bass drivers so all four bass drivers are powered by 1400 watts of amplification per speaker so between a pair of speakers you have 2800 watts covering the the base section of the speaker leaving the top half passive for the user to uh, complement with uh, whatever amplifier he chooses um, in the technology section the tweeter and the mid-range are both pure beryllium tweeters the mid-range uh, is an 8 inch beryllium mid-range so beautiful mids and highs that come with the uh, beryllium one of the very few companies that, that utilize uh, brilliant in our tweeter and especially in the mid-range. I can see that the the design of the top two is quite special. Is this um, especially from you or is it a normal design for all of the other speakers? Uh, this is a, a very specific design by Paradigm and it's not just to look pretty even though it is quite uh, attractive. It is a, a perforated phase alignment lens so it actually has a performance advantage for both the tweeter and the mid-range to help the, the, the performance of the speaker. Okay so John tell us about Anthem. What are you showing here? Okay well Showing today, we have our latest generation. This is our third generation receiver uh, from Anthem now. Uh, we have three models, the 520, the 720, and the 1120. Uh, what you see here is our MRX 1120 with 11 channels of amplification. So Dolby Atmos is the, the, the craze word now. Everybody wants to know, is it, can we do Dolby Atmos? Is it Dolby Atmos ready? And with 11 uh, channels of amplification, you don't need to add anything further. Uh, the model below the 720 can also do Dolby Atmos uh, by adding a uh, four-channel receiver, uh, sorry, a four-channel amplifier to get the 11 channels of amplification. So it is a seven channel that can expand to 11. And then at the entry level is the 520, which is a five-channel receiver, which, you know, the masses, for the most part, still use five-channel receivers and don't have the luxury of putting 11 speakers throughout an environment. So it's still a very viable receiver uh, in the category. Um, so a couple of the technologies that are different from this generation to the last, obviously we have the latest in HDMI 2.0 and HDCP 2.2. Uh, PlayFi technology has been added to the 720 and the 1120, uh, which is for the, the, streaming, uh, the streaming masses that, that want to play their, their Spotify or their Deezer or their Tidal uh, in high res. So all of the receivers from the 720 up uh, have the, the streaming capability as well. So when do you launch it? Oh, these launched uh, just after uh, January of this year, so we're, we're all ready to market. Uh, and in fact, we were really excited to launch the new AVM60, which is the replacement to our previous generation AVM50. Uh, so again, you have the HDMI, the HDCP, the PlayFi technology, and, and most importantly, what you see here is our, our room correction microphone. So all Anthem uh, equipment comes standard with, with uh, Anthem room correction, which is ARC. So how would you use it, for instance, with the Paradigm speakers which I saw? Well, I mean, the beauty of, of Anthem Room Correction is it works with any speakers. Uh, we always say Paradigm and Anthem, they're designed together, so they sound the best together. Uh, so really what it does is uh, the, the microphone goes into the room and it, and it measures the, the uh, output from the speaker through multiple positions in the room and creates a, a custom curve to take care of uh, all the in, uh, deficiencies of the room uh, to make a better sound. And how would an, in an installer see these uh, deficiencies and all of that? You have a software, don't you? Absolutely. So within the software that's run from your laptop, once the, the measurements have been done, you can actually see what's happening in the room in the various positions. Uh, so you can see where there's a, a dip or a boost in the room, uh, which is where you're going to cause all of the, the, the problems with distortion. Would an installer give these uh, graphics to their clients? Absolutely, that's one of the key features in Anthem is you can print out all of the graphs and present it to the client to show what improvements have been done in the room just by using ARC. Thank you very much, John. Hey guys, thanks for watching our video. Click below to subscribe and be sure to follow Inside CI on Twitter, Facebook and Google+.